Hey there guys, Justin here again. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be testing uh, page file on versus page file off for the performance in gaming. So straight off the bat, what you'll do is you'll go to the Windows icon over here. It's type in advanced system. So you want to go to advanced system settings, go to settings, go to advanced, change. So you can either uh, set it to Windows automatically manage your paging file. You can put in a custom size. So generally the custom size is either eight gigs or 16 gigs, or you can have no paging file. So in this benchmark, what I did is a benchmark automatically uh, managed paging file by Windows against no paging file against a custom size of either eight gig or 16 gigs. So let's get to my results. That's what you have for. So all my games were tested at medium settings. Where there was FSR 2.0 or 2.1 available, I used the quality setting. I used the latest NVIDIA driver 528.02. So as mentioned before, I tested page file set to off, page file set to automatic, page file set to 8 gigabytes and page file 16, set to 16 gigabytes so let's get to my results so i benchmarked eight games i added the total fps up i divided by eight to get my average fps and then i did the same thing for the one percent lows so for page file set to off my total fps over eight games was 576 and then that gives me an average FPS per game of 70.88 and then when I added up all the 1% lows I got a 1% low total of 426 and then when I divide that by 8 my average 1% low is 53.25 and that gives me a stability rating of 75.13% that's with page file set to off with page file set to automatic I got a total FPS over eight games of 564. My average FPS per game was 70.5. And then I did the same thing for the 1% lows. My total 1% lows were 429. And then my average 1% low per game was 53.63. Divided this figure by this figure, and then I got to 76% stability. So as you can see, page file set to automatic is already better than page file set to off due to the fact that it's more stable then but my my testing isn't done when i set my page file to 8 gigabyte or 8192 over the eight games my total fps was 571 as you can see that's the highest it's been so far and then my average fps per game was 71.38 yet again at the highest it's been so far um, my 1% lows over the 8 games was 437 and then when I divide that by 8 it was 54.63 FPS 1% low per game yet again the highest has been so far so when I divide this by my average FPS per game I actually get a stability rating of 76.53% which is definitely the highest has been so far so guys I'll, uh, look I mean I can go through the figures for 16 gigabytes but it's less um, you can see it's got less FPS over here it's got less average FPS it's got less 1% low it's got less 1% low average and it only it's got a stability rating of 5.13 so guys if you're looking to go for the absolute best performance set your page file to 8 gigabytes you're going to get the highest FPS, the highest 1% lows, and your, your games are going to be the most stable that they could be. So there you have it. Those are the results. So how you go about that, just click on the Windows icon yet again, type in advanced. Uh, type in advanced. Why am I typing wrong? Sorry. System. Okay. And then go to settings. Go to advanced go to change and then if it's on automatic just untick this um, and then go to custom size set the initial size to 8192 set the maximum size to 8192 click set 
press OK. It's going to give you a prompt to restart your computer. Guys, it's going to yield you the best results. I know that it's a fraction of a FPS here, a fraction of a percentage here, but we are in 2023. So unless you got very high in the hardware like an RTX card or like a, a 20 core processor or something like that, our hardware is starting to get old. So 1% improvement here, plus 5% improvement there, plus 3% improvement there, it makes a difference guys. Anyways, that's my two cents. But guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash that like button. If you haven't subscribed to the channel this yet, please do go ahead and do so. Other than that, guys, have a good day. It's people like you. Cheers.